No need to throw away your old worn out boots no or need. high heels. Today we're using yeah. those old soles for a new purpose. <laughs> Isn't that so clever? Do you want to say it again? Well, I giggled when okay. I wrote that in there. <laughs> Guess what? I said the same thing on my Facebook page. Great you did? Great yes. minds think alike. Wow. Yeah. Okay, Hildy, our favorite uh, artist, our goat is here goat. today. Uh, Can't get kind of used to that word. Doing an upcycling project here. It is. Well, succulents are very popular, aren't they? Aren't yeah. they? Very. Chris, they are. Chris is always talking about succulents. <laughs> yeah. It's like salsa. Succulents and salsa. It's just fun to say. But, so, we looked into it back when I grew up on the farm. Mom and the ladies uh, gardening club and stuff would do this with boots. Old boots. And then it's come back around like things do, yeah. you know? So I saw it on somebody, another friend had shared it. Um, uh, and so I thought, well, that would be kind of fun. Reach out to you. Here we are. Yes. Bing, bang, boom. So the thing is, I didn't have any old boots, except this, my daughter's Doc Martens from 2005. Oh, my goodness. And she saw it on Facebook. She goes, whoa, are those my Doc Martens? <laughs> <laughs> you know, she's 32 with two children now. She wasn't ready to let go of it. <laughs> she was. Okay. <laughs> So that, and then this boot, like, I went to the thrift store and found this little bugger, right? It's not like a genuine cowboy boot, but, because they don't have the really dirty boots there. Right. So, so I dirtied it up and... with um, uh... some spray paint. I just put it on a rag and scrubbed it up. Nice. And then I did the same with the shoes, and I just spray painted it, because I love spray paint. <laughs> and that was fun. I love spray paint, too. Right? <laughs> yes. Yeah. So then... The thing that I want to tell you is, I don't have time to chat, Chris. So the thing <laughs> that I want to tell you is, I planted these first, then I read about it afterwards. <laughs> and I learned what I did wrong. Here we go. Okay. First I love of this all, learning lesson. Yeah, you should have a drainage hole. So maybe take, if you're going to really, you know, nurture these and keep them for a while. And so you would take a drill and just, zzz, you know drills. You love power I love tools. drills. He is so, very hands-on. Ready? We do, <laughs> ready? We do that. Yeah. We do that. Oh, that's an old, this is Tool time? Yeah. Tim Allen. Well yeah, yeah, done. there we go. Thank you. Huh. Man. <laughs> I'm that, on fire. That, that spray paint didn't, yeah. didn't go all the way there, huh? <laughs> I tried not to breathe. So then I went and I took, so before you, I thought, how? I don't want to cut a big hole because I have to put dirt in there. Yes. So that's good. So <laughs> just do, I like a cross thing. Oh, okay. With a knife. Be careful. It was, okay. you know, and cut. Then put the dirt in there. I used the wrong kind of soil. <laughs> You know, I just use the same soil for everything. If you want to get in for the indoor ones or outdoor ones, they have succulent soil. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, which means it's got more clay. Succulents uh, do not like too much water. I oh. they were going to say they had boot soil, but I was... No, they could probably market Maybe. that on Amazon and make a million. <laughs> so we'll do that next. And <laughs> so the succulents want to be in dry because they're like a cacti. <clears throat> and that's why they're cactus. nice plants for people who aren't really a right, clean Right, exactly. Thumb. And this, when I bought it, I just bought it because it was spiky and big, but it's aloe vera. Which, which is, is perfect for summer. Ooh. So yeah. if I burn again, I yeah. can just <laughs> I can just go to your boot. <laughs> go to go your go-to boot. boot. And I thought this it was kind of adorable. It is very adorable. Um, and I spray, oh, I told you that already. <laughs> I forgot because I spray painted it. <laughs> um, what else? Succulents. Oh, so if you plant them, then wait a couple days before you water. Oh, really? Yes, because the roots are traumatized. Uh, <laughs> traumatic. And so when you pull this out of the little <clears throat> container it comes with, take out as much, real gently, as much of that old soil as you can and have the roots, and then put in the new, give it a couple days rest, <laughs> reacclimate to the world, and just douse it with... Did you um, happen to write a new song, too, when you were doing this? The succulent song? No, oh. these boots are... Oh, I'm going to succulent song? <laughs> <laughs> I was just, we could do that too. Yeah, I was just singing, telling you what you want, what you really, really. You can do this, spray it. Yes. And, or, and then I thought, how am I going to get it down to the toe? I wondered for days about that. No, I didn't, but a couple minutes. And then I thought, oh, you take the, take some water, get it in, and just stick it in, find the little hole in there. Steel toes, don't try to cut That's through those. Right. Unless you have a power or, tool. Or yeah. you could just Ow. buy you could buy the uh, fake succulents and there still have this beautiful <laughs> boot as well. I'm always looking for the or easy way Or a ceramic boot. <laughs> yeah, that too. <laughs> Kay Hildy, thank you so much for coming thank in you. today. Oh, so creative. I might try this one at home. I like it. Stay with us coming up next. How to keep cool on this hot day. We have some fun summer drinks thanks to Happy Harry's.